While I'm on this west side highway, I sit, keys swing by my knees, fist full of my dreams, pistol by the sea, piss but what it seems, I fish for all I need, kiss this sun at ease, this window without a breeze. So I be wasting my time, but what's the latest? Sitting in this traffic, they asking if he gon' make it. Break a break a one nine, what's your location? Don't even come in the furthest thing from the station. Welcome Shit. to the hip hop attic it shows another installment with the illest underground yeah. Talk about it. show on the fucking universe with your man John Figs. De la music and the rock. Yo, Ooh. and we got to welcome the new year special with a special Ooh. guest. Ooh. Let's go. Say we're going to take it to the brother that mothers this rap Ooh. shit. Talk about it. Oh, uh, mm. Bronx Talk Bonner. about it. Talk about it. You know what I'm saying? You got the big pun, Beat Nuts Connect. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Oh, BS that. Corona Connect. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Not, Keep going. I like that. I like that. <laughs> Keep going. Bold the Katona out, Ave we off and the bugs, somewhere baby. else in Queens Connect. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, tonight we're kicking it with Solo Jones. What's up, brother? Yo, what's up, gang? Peace. Peace to everybody. Like, cameras. Hell, hey, Seven down, blessings. Right there. Peace. <laughs> Peace to all the blessings in the world. Hi, right, gentlemen. How Yo. are we doing today? It's a long time coming, Yo, man. It's long been time. a long time coming. I'm happy to be here, man. Yeah, nah, I'm man. We, to... we glad you came out. You made the trip. This is, this is great. I you love know, this. A borough over. <laughs> it wasn't that far, man. Y'all right over the bridge. It was actually a, you know, hop skip over here. I hop skip was right there. Yeah, I rolled my ass over here in like four and a half minutes. I ain't even finished my shit. shit's right there. Man. Yeah, right. yeah, I put it out. I was like, shit, I'm here. I got to <laughs> be respectful. I don't want to just walk in there big, blunt, lit and shit. That's, <laughs> that's like not a way to introduce yourself. Got to keep it up, you man. bring that shit. Don't worry yeah, about it. Now got... that I know, I would have so <laughs> done that. It's been, it's been a few months that we've been trying to get this together. <laughs> yeah, man. And yeah. we finally got it. Yeah. Um, but in the meanwhile, we've been seeing you grinding, doing your thing, new okay. videos, new music. Working. You know, you just you trying. you you stay on it, man. Trying, trying to do as much as I can. So we we've been we've been looking at all your music videos, all of that. We know you. We feel like we know you at this point. But <laughs> to the people that don't know you as well as we do, um, how do you start this music? This music how, how did I start, or yeah. how do I start? Yeah, where did it come from? from? Like, well, how'd you got into the whole music oh, thing? Oh shit! Oh, like we talking about? Go back to your diapers if you got to. From the, from the start, I fell from the sky one day. <laughs> boom! From now I'm in the world. I walked through and I just landed in the studio and I just boom. What? <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> I was all of eight minutes old, and boom, big, big with a mic in my hand. Mic in my hand <laughs> came out swinging, full beard and everything. What? Uh, the beard was full. Left the beard was full. Left my studio session for the first time. Landed, uh, boom, pff, first what? performance. Um, umbilical cord was. I, the I mic wasn't even was forty-five on. minutes old, bro. Uh, oh yeah, the session was real quick too. Like wow. the the nigga had no infamous. Uh, no, uh, what's the what's the infamous? Uh, infamous. 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 Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Man, you got no infamous yeah, Let me so ask the niggas with kids. Go, let me ask the niggas with kids. I was like, man, y'all gotta go, bro. Guys gotta move, well, son. Got so now, now, yeah. boom. So now we here. So now, wow. Well, yeah, and then ten thousand hours later. <laughs> nah, nah, but dead ass though. We really want to know. The whole, we want to like, know how Solomon Jones came music, to be. Came to be when you wrote your oh, first shit, scene. Man, jumped nah. in the booth. Yeah, I was a literal kid, man. This is this shit is like really a part of who you are at mm-hmm. this point. Like I was a child. When mm. I was doing this, like I have a kid right now, he's 14 years old, and I watch him as a child, or from from being a child, like do this music shit, and I'm like, oh shit, this was me, a kid. I was 10 years old, making my first beats and writing my first. So your, your kid oh, is into the music thing too. Yeah, fire. he's nice. He does That's drill. Dope. He does drill music. He's you know he thinks he's sturdier than me. Tell him oh, to kill oh, that. Yeah, they That's get bad. down. They get he's down. He's actually really is sturdier than me, but I gotta like you know. <laughs> You show him, you show him, man. No, nah, no, nah, I don't. Nah? He shows me. He's actually really nice, but I got to keep it together, you know what I mean? Because yeah. I'd be like, nah, nah, you're not as nice as me, so I, you know, I still got to show him. You be throwing, him. like, the butterfly in there? Like, nah, nah, I, I be cooking him sometimes, yeah. but nah, he's really nice. I really got to, like, pull my pants up when it's time to fucking go, because if not, he'll show me out. He'll have his camera out. I'll be on TikTok. Oh, <laughs> It'll be 80,000 views on me, not winning, and <laughs> now somehow it's linked back to me. Then I get the shit on, I'm tagged on Instagram. It's like, yo, Solo Jones gets yeah. dusted in that yeah, like dance battle dance. and i'm like dogs what the fuck is going on it's my kid this is 9 a.m on a tuesday morning how am i getting what yeah so this you got to be really on point when you got teenage kids you in your house that's that's it. a that's a life lesson if nobody told you 
If you yeah. have teenage kids, be on point all day. Have a shape I up. I mean, especially now, too. Like you said with the TikTok, and everything's yeah, recorded. Everything's bro. recorded. Mm-hmm. I'm on the internet nonstop. I feel like my life is like a, a fucking reality show. A reality show. show. Yo, Truman so show. Man, you the Truman show. But that's what the Jim Carrey, right? Yeah, the Jim Carrey show. But that's what social oh, media shit. is. My son is 14 years old, trying to... All right, so picture this. He really like tries to make pranks on me. He got a good buzzing audience on TikTok. So you he wakes up, he puts his phone somewhere that I can't see, mm. and shit. And we're having a regular conversation in the kitchen. I'm I'm scratching my ass. It's nine o'clock in the fucking morning. I still got booger in my eye and shit. I'm really just trying to get my life together. I'm making coffee, and this no motherfucker is like frauding me, doing some shit that I'm not aware of, and I gotta keep it together. If not, I'm gonna be a hundred thousand views tomorrow going with, viral. with that same Word. fucking booger in my eye. But you gotta <laughs> respect you gotta respect that, right? Because when you started, shit. right? I love that shit. When you started, that wasn't available. That platform wasn't available for us. It's the most amazing thing in the world to watch him be able to show his artistic side Mm -hmm. we have have this plug of of creation something that we didn't have we i had we had a book you know i mean i could write sit here write bars and shit all day that's what we still got that's our venting space this motherfucker right here he just has the world of of y'all seen the the app the um the joint that you could record what's the name of the joint on the app that no band lab band lab band lab allows you to record music straight on his phone, just his phone, mm-hmm. his headphones, something that 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 has a microphone straight into his phone, and he can mix down his joints. He can add auto tune, reverb, That's compression. That's crazy. All we, the, we, uh, we talk about that all the day. Shit, like to the point, was like that. Where it was mm-hmm. like, damn, yeah. I could record some freestyles on. He showed me, and I was like, oh shit, this shit's not. It's and not it the sounds greatest, good. The quality, but yeah, how's the quality? It's, it's, it'll get through if I want to do a freestyle real quick. I could do this shit right here, right now. Mm-hmm. They have access to that. Yeah. Shit that we we ain't had none of that. <laughs> none of what that. We, none of that. What did we have? We had a fucking extra sketch. Fucking now nah, we had cassette other. tapes. Remember we used to record on cassette tapes and the mic and uh, yo don't fuck up if it's a feature. Fuck damn, it's th- four of us here. Oh my god, the first dude you not fuck up because then we had to start all over. Yeah, you can't. There wasn't no punching in. in. Nah, nah. Wow, well, but passing the mic. Not even that, but <laughs> something that he has that we didn't have is that that par- parental support. Mm-hmm. And that's that plays the a real biggest big thing. part. And that you plays, know, that plays us, one of the biggest parts, especially in a in a Latino mm-hmm. household. Muchacho, el diablo, go get a job or go to school. What are you doing? Were you get wasting your time? Head. Turn that racket shit off. Yes, and that be me. I still do that. Oh. I ever gonna be like, yo, turn? You be playing some drill shit? You playing some <clears throat> some whatever he be playing? Don't get me wrong, I like it. Uh, I be like a certain shit, but some shit is certain just like extent, too, right? Yeah, it's be it's like, ah, it's oh, mad man. Batman noises and shit coming from like little fourteen year old kids. <clears throat> I be like, yo, turn this fucking racket shit the fuck off. I yo, this <clears throat> shit is giving me a fucking headache. I'm having an aneurysm in three and a half minutes if you keep this shit rocking, and then <clears throat> I. I stop and I listen to myself. I be like, "Wow, I am my parent. I am the old nigga now. Holy mm, shit!" You start becoming it. You don't even know it. Yo, <laughs> and I I listen to the disconnect of what it is. I be like, "Damn, I really don't like this shit. Turn this shit the fuck off." And I could imagine that's how my <laughs> folks was when I was playing the shit that I was. And mm. yeah, that's crazy. Well, you and you and E got something in common. Kill that drill. Let's rap for real. Kill that drill later. shit, man. Don't get me wrong. There's lane, a lane for it. I respect it. Yeah, no, it. there is a lane. There's a lane for everything. I listen to some, you know, certain joints. I'm a fan of certain joints. I can't, you can't run away from it. We New York artists. We New York folk. Like, it's it's here. It's part of the culture. It is what it is, you know, and I have respect for it, and I, and I love certain shit, but my son be listening to that shit all day, every day. I'd be like, bro, can you play some, like, pop music or something? Mm. Like, I, 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 I listen to any Anything beyond this right now. Except this shit. <laughs> it's not going nowhere, man. We we gotta learn to to live with it. It's man, a phase. So it's a phase and that shit that shit's already dying. Even if it's not a phase, you know what I mean? It's even dying. If, even if it's something that, that that lives and moves on, we we respect it and we hold it dear because mm-hmm. it's something that our youth is is tied to. Yep. And if our youth is tied to it, we have to be tied to our youth. It's yep. the only way we'll keep connection. And that's the only way we'll keep the idea of a culture alive. Mm. That's the only reason why I embrace it. Yeah, you have, we have to. To a certain extent. If now we're going to be like, we're going to look like some old ass. Exactly. Yeah, I, I, don't, I, don't, I, I don't want to get pointed out. I don't want to get pointed out being that old head nigga. Yeah, who this nigga? 
this old nigga that nah, dude, we not doing that to me. First and foremost, I will, I will sturdy, I will, I will shine all you motherfuckers. I will mm. hit the floor. Then, you know, what? So, so it's safe to say there's no drill music coming from Solo Jones. Nah, that's not. But a fact. what music is coming from you right now? So L- let's talk about that. Let's talk a little about your your music right now. Soul music. So music, soul, soul, hard music, something that, that you can feel, something that 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 make you walk away with, that like you can that. walk away with, a feeling, a vibe, but it, deeper than that, a thought, mm. a, a start of a thought process, you know, something that's vague enough for you to create your own idea, but non vague, not vague enough. What's the opposite word of vague? Um, um, specific, 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 yeah, specific yeah. enough for it to target you mm-hmm. personally, you know. So it's hard to create that balance, but I feel like I'm in a space where I just want to give heart, just want to write heart, yeah, yeah, that, yeah, means, like, that means something. To me. And that, your new joint traffic is I, is Thank exactly you. that. It's real soulful, very chill. Yeah, 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 yeah. I want to say your uh, rhyme patterns on it, like it's just real chill. You know, uh, beyond the words, right? Just your flow, your your cadence on it. The metaphors. You can feel it, yeah. The yeah, metaphors yeah. when you just <laughs> fucking around with that. Like, yo, it's a traffic getting into this game. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah, that's no, how and, I the, and then the video concept was genius. Spike Lee shit, You right? know, inspired, little cart, inspired right? by A little Mario shit. Kart type shit. <laughs> uh, that ass, like, that's what we try to go. I try to make a, a car without... I try to make a car without it being an actual car. I want you to know it's not a car. Right. Right? What were you yeah. riding, though, in that video? A dolly. It was a dolly. Yeah, that's like a studio yeah. dolly. You know the dolly that they use to to shoot with. They'll they'll have like a director shooting yeah, yeah. dolly, sitting on the it. camera on it. And they'll sit on it, and somebody will push the dolly, and they'll actually shoot the camera. I just turned the camera around and made it face me. You you it's went to a gas nice. station. You, you, you did anything. We you rode around the whole fucking city. Was Everybody was watching you. Right? I, didn't, I didn't do half the shit that I was trying to do. I'm gonna be real with you, bro. I was I was trying to take that shit to the gym. What? I was trying. To, <laughs> <laughs> I was trying to bring that shit to the studio. You feel me? I was got, all right. So, the idea, the ideology of the song "Traffic" and what I was trying to convey, um, it's deeper than a car ride. We use the car ride to show the the tangible idea of traffic. Mm-hmm. But in real life, the song is about success of life the traffics of life mm-hmm. our destination being our success and one of your lyrics you say we're stuck in this together you know basically life we all here we got to work together this not- whole shit is just us moving in the same way we, whatever direction we're going whatever speed we're going i'm gonna be late but i'm gonna get there <laughs> you know i seen it started raining while you were recording yeah it's a fact did it mess up the equipment? Absolutely. <laughs> oh, damn, <laughs> bro. Absolutely, bro. Worst shit of my day. Uh, but, nah, we actually got through it. It, it, it we, listen, I, I work with a team of soldiers. We, we, but actually, I'm going to be real with you. The, the rain kind of, it made it cooler. To, to be honest, it was harder to work in. You know, it was like one of the elements of, of, of the earth that was like, all right, now you got this against you. And you got this yeah. against you. And then God was like, it worked out. And then I'm going to make it fucking rain too. Yeah. And I was like, word, say that. Let's go with it. But it felt like it was supposed, it felt like that was supposed to have, I was supposed to see the rain. I was supposed to have the rain smudge up certain shots on the, on the camera. It worked out perfectly. Mm, nice. No, nice. And the video is. Like it Genius, creative is creative. Man. Mint is yeah, and that's 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 yeah, the that's main what we thing. Like about it. It's very creative and it's it's right. It's not thirty niggas behind you. And that's one thing. Right? It's not thirty niggas rhyming. Hey, said, you trying to look a, hard. Like when we post a sign on a group that's just chat, getting old quick. Then our music is like, yo, <laughs> is this thirty motherfuckers behind them rapping? And I'm and like, nah, this is some, he's like, alright I want to watch because he hates that shit. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I just seen it too many times. It is cool. I mean, so yeah. a New York feel. Yeah, yeah. But they, it's been done already. So the fact that you you have a bunch of different things Thanks, is dope. Man. That creativity that you bring into it. Thanks. You're man. thinking outside the box, man. Yeah, we love we, that. We think with what we have available with our resources. You know what I mean? That's a big thing. That's a big, That's a big thing. As an independent art, are you independent artist? Right, yeah. Nah, so right. you, you got to gather the resources that you do have right. and make everything work. I make so, that shit work with my budget. Man. Exactly. And just yeah. the rain. That shit could have been like a problem. Oh shit, they got a problem. Like, nah, that's some that's mother nah, nature. That's real life, right? You there. know what I'm saying? I was drenched. Yeah. Bro, I was fucking. Are you a video videographer as well? Yeah. Yeah. I just don't be doing it. 
is a lot of time is very time consuming i used to all right so back to resources we do shit and we do shit in life and we learn things as a direct result of being broke as fuck i explain i needed beats when i was a kid because i couldn't license the songs that i was doing to get money off of them I needed beats. We didn't know how to make beats. We just started making beats. Mm, I needed album covers. I needed video shots. This guy's charging six, eight hundred dollars for a joint. This guy's charging a thousand dollars. I don't got that type of money, but I do got Mm. this five hundred bucks that I'm gonna go cop this camera with and figure it out by myself. Multiply that shit. Then you figure it out. YouTube University. Yep. (laughs) Facts. You get yourself a little Final Cut Pro, and then you become. Now you use your weakness. Now you be as a as a superpower. Mm-hmm. Now I'm a videographer, fakely. Now I got oh, who does your videos? Shit's fire. Ah uh, ah. Uh. Yeah, me. Oh, word, how much you charge? XYZ. Say less. Now I'm getting paid through this medium that I was lacking before because you know, it's just a lot of time. You learn. Shit. Now yeah, it's it's better, right? It's better to pick that shit up and learn. Yeah. Cause then when you do have the budget to pay for it. Mm-hmm. You already can lay it out for the person that you paying to do it for you. Yeah, no, nah, it really becomes your superpower. Now yeah. I already I jump into songs, knowing what I want my videos to look like. I, I, a, I see uh, the 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 painting. Yeah, that's a the, the, the that's final a, product yeah. before I even start writing. That's a big. That's a big vision. Uh, As a videographer, you that just that, that yeah. comes, especially if it's like a song or a beat that you know. Oh no, nah, this is something something right here. Yeah, you like, know, especially I mean? like a specific beat. I always say like, yo, the yeah. beat. Is the beat is what is gonna is is the is the start of everything, right? You can't you can't rhyme without a fucking beat. But the beat, you could tell already the concept you already want to have for that song, mm-hmm. and it's all about the execution at the end at the end of it. Yeah, it's the beat. you know, it's the beat. execute the song, and then you know, if you already have that vision of the video, like you said, ahead of it, like it actually that's makes gold right there. Things easier when you go about writing. Because now you have this idea of what you want your video to look like. You could just write to whatever you see capable that you. And because you, when you live in a like a, a realist mind state, I only shoot, or I'm, I'm thinking about videos within my means. I'm not thinking about shit out of my control. Mm-hmm. Like if I'm thinking about yachts and shit, it's only because I, I'm in a space where I can. Because you, you, yeah, yachts you, and shit you can get a fucking yacht. Right, I can get a fucking yacht right <laughs> now. Go- my, I, I know how to make that phone call and be like, yo, yo, hey, listen, I need a yacht. Yeah. You know what I mean? But, you know, five, ten, ten years ago, I wasn't thinking like that. I was thinking within my yeah, means. Nah, yeah. So I'm thinking within the box that I have and what I could do. So if I know, all right, this is what is available to me in the middle of my writing, I'm going to think I'm going to write within that that ideology so you can shoot that and as though, convey man. the message. Yeah. That's, that's, that's the whole point of artists. Yeah. Uh, artists, that, and that's a great great point you know as an artist you have to maneuver you have to maneuver and do everything sometimes you have to do everything yourself you gotta mm-hmm. be more than one you have to be more than one wear many hats yeah you have to yeah you have no other choice but to Spe- like, speaking about artists you with something that we notice as a uh, your stage presence hey. i know you i know people tell you bro that shit is fire i'll be i'll be trying i'll be working That's you, you know how to control the crowd you know, you know what you need to do up on that stage, man. That's that's a comfort space. Yeah, man. And we were we 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 started wondering like where he got his stage present from. Like, did he get inspired? Like, what about like the music that 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 you put out? Did you get inspired when you was younger? And at this point, I, I know you're gonna say something. Um, every time we got somebody on the platform, we ask them the same question: mm. Was their top five? Oh, so right now <laughs> we want to know what's your top five, fellas. I think it's time, yo. I that time. time, yo. Time for the top five. Greatest, greatest of all time. Check it out, y'all. Giving y'all the best. As we go a little something like this. Boom. Your obvious is your Nas, your Eminem, your obvious Andre 3000, your obvious um, Kanye West, your obvious. Oh, um, I gotta take a little step back. I'm I'm gonna go and say Rakim, Eric B. I'm mm. gonna take a step Ooh. back and I'm gonna say the way Gangstar um created their they started like the fundamentals for me of, mm. of what it meant to have one artist and one producer. One producer, and one sound. One oh, sound, shit. one cold 
a cohesive sound. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And I can't even say that because I have no cohesive sounds. Everything I do sounds fucking different. As yeah, fun. no, you got a lot of, Everything you got so, a lot. I can't even say that you shit. You got a lot of mix. But, That's what's dope about you, though, as an artist, because you know how to, you, you, you jump. You try different things. Yeah, no, I just, I'm everywhere. I wake up to somebody else every day. But the <laughs> ideology of that of that cohesiveness of being that art, I know what I'm getting when I when I wanted to listen to them. Mm-hmm. Like I know what my realm was, where I was at when I wanted to throw on some gang star. You feel mm-hmm. me? So it, I I enjoyed the cohesiveness of them. I enjoyed the cohesiveness of De La Soul and a tribe mm-hmm. and tribe. You know. And that that shaped me as well. That was my. They last so about to be, about to be available on streaming soon. Spotify. It's not it's not up yet. I nah, it was, I, 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 March. I think they said oh, March. 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 They said March. But shit, we ain't been able to stream to nothing from. Congratulations to them. That shows you how fucked up the fucking. Yeah, the how fucked is. up the game is. Right, game is pretty it's fucked, fucked up. up. It's always traffic. Game is pretty fucked up. So you know, I feel like I feel like you know, and I it, it, I feel like the same people having that issue is the beating us with the Stone Crazy album. Can't put it up because you can't stream that shit nowhere. Mm. You mentioned so that yeah, last this time, is a yeah. classic album that you can't stream nowhere. Same shit with like De La Soul That's situation. So you can't stream none of this shit. I feel like that yo with that album for some reason you can't find that shit nowhere. Yeah, yeah. and before, I think they did before we go that. away too 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 much. That Solar Jones top twenty three. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yo, he That's had right. top five A and B. He had an A and B side on that. Uh, <laughs> had the first five and then the next five. Performance. Oh, yeah, he was giving us five performance. performance. Yeah, yeah, nah. He was official, talking about official. performance yeah, that he like admires. There's layers, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah no, and there is. Yeah, there definitely it's, 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 is. Like, uh, the, I go as far as to say, like, this is how layered it gets. You know Trent Reznor, Nine Inch Nails? Like, mm-hmm. that's how layered this shit gets, the way he pro- he. Pro- he produces his music. That's an aftermath math artist. You feel me? Dr. Dre did The Fragile, his uh, fourth album or some shit like that. Dr. Dre did a lot of the production. They're on an alternative that's group. That's how I found yeah. out about them. And that's how that starts shaping your sound too, shaping your, your writing as well. Mm-hmm. So when you say you top five, and it's crazy because I throw, I throw that man, I throw Trent Reznor to my top five songwriters. That man could out rap rappers that I know. You feel me? But you can't say that in a room full of rappers. You'd be like, "What the fuck are you talking now about?" He's surprising you, like like uh, Fred Durst. Remember Fred, Fred Durst? Durst was a hell of a, a, yeah. a writer too. That yeah. was a writer writer. Mm-hmm. People don't give him yeah, as much try as he met the man. Yeah, yeah man. But yeah, he, he spent some shit on that song. Yeah. Yeah. He like you gotta he give people their props, right? man. Yeah, he did. He did. You gotta give a lot of people their props. And the, the whole thing about the way where it really the effect is is in the imagery. The imagery, yo. The imagery uh, behind the music, it. right? Like you talking about, you make a song and then you already know how you want it to look and sound. Yeah. There's a lot of artists, yo. We know mad dope artists, dope MCs, but they don't know how to take it beyond that. That's the hardest part for people, right? Is is how to put it out to the masses, how to put it in a visual form because it's too much pressure though. And a lot of people don't like and they can't deal with it and they think that shit's just gonna come to them, but that's not how it works. It's, it's too much pressure. Not how it works and that shit that you learn when you when you run and you hustling and pushing yourself independently. Ain't nobody gonna come and bring it to you. Nobody gonna it ain't it ain't the it ain't the oh shit, yo. Nobody got shit. Niggas for you. hear too many stories about yo, I was just, you know, oh, I just met this dude and he put me on, this big artist, right? Eminem heard me and, oh, he, he liked my shit. Nope. That shit don't happen every day. That's not how it works. That's not the typical. It's the lottery. I'm tell you right now, there's a news flash. <laughs> Niggas ain't got shit for you. Uh, Go outside and get the shit on your own. Exactly. Uh, figure Go. this shit out. Yeah. Go find a niche. Find a market. Find yep. a corner. Find your find thing. Find a pocket and exist in that fucking pocket. Until you find your way out of it. Like a kangaroo, man. <laughs> Wait, what the fuck? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> like a kangaroo, <laughs> man. I was a good alley. Get in your pouch, your pouch baby. Get like in your, pouch. Man. your fucking <laughs> pouch, dogs. I was gangster, man. Go find your pouch, <laughs> get in it, <laughs> conquer it, and get out of it, right? <laughs> Yo, first, it looks like you're going to say something nah, real nah, crazy. Boy, speaking of performing. But before you say that. What's up? That was we got to take a little break. We do? We we got, got, yo, got. I just got an email. Corporate. They on that ass. Yo, they want to take us a quick break. We'll be right back, y'all. I paid a bill.
Yep. The bills got to get paid, back. y'all. And we're back. And we're back. back. That's why the lights are. Right here. Yeah, <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Shit. And Shout make sure you do whatever <laughs> that was about. Facts. Twice. I don't know about that sometimes. <laughs> I don't know what it was, but make sure you get two of them. <laughs> but um, speaking of, you know, doing the whole having a stage presence, you know, the the performances, that, that, that aspect of being an artist, that's one of the illest, right? Because you get to feel that rush. And, um, yo, we seen you on the Rory and Mile joint, man. Yeah, you jumped yeah. on stage. Yeah, that was... Um, and you just did, like, some improv shit. Yeah. yeah you, did some, you did some Joel Santana shit? Yeah. Cameron and Jay-Z. Yeah, okay. right, right. a lot of shit. You right. did more than one. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I did. Yo, bro, actually. What was that? Right, so, I didn't see it. So, <laughs> Tell me about it. I want to know. Yeah. All right. So in real life, that was like a 40, 45 minute segment that I just like skimmed down to like into a couple minute video because I wasn't about to post like a half hour video. Right, right. I got you. Crazy. So, but it was really like luck of like my life. I was really just standing in the audience and I, I had a certain energy um towards my direction throughout the whole show um, your vibe your vibe it, it was positive. just it was yeah it was just a good positive vibe a lot of energy was thrown my way th- throughout the show um and towards the end of the show he had uh they wanted to do a versus he wanted to do a new york versus and everybody in the audience was like he was like who you thinking he could do a new york versus right everybody was like ah you know i could do it you know blah 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 and he was like all right so who going to do it Everybody put their hands down. Oh. <laughs> oh, Everybody was just pet. <laughs> me too. I was like, nah, I ain't gonna do that shit. You <laughs> ain't gonna have me out here fucked up. But they people started pointing at me because I guess I look like the fucking honorary Timberland boot of the fucking audience. I don't know what the fuck that was about. <laughs> but motherfuckers is pointing at me like, nah, he could do it. This guy right here, I know he can. He look like the most New York nigga in the world. Uh, uh. And I'm like, they were, right. business, they were right. They were right. What the fuck, man? And I'm like, I, I guess. So they pointed. He was like, he would point. He was like, you want to do it? My pointed directly at me. Now, now is I'm standing there. The light is on me. Motherfucker, cameraman is on me. All these it. tables, they just went like this. Nah. They all looked at me. I was like, yeah, get the fuck out of here. I'm on my way. And I just nah. bumped off the stage, and that was it. We just went through. I came on stage. Put up, <laughs> nigga. It's me, Solo Jones. Ah, ah, Big Bronx energy. Brr, and that was it. It became. Literally within a minute's time, it became our show. Yeah, yeah, yeah you it took was, over. It was, it was That's how you gotta do it. That's how you gotta do over. it. And then they played the music, and then that was it. When we did the first song, because I was like, nah, this is this, this, this how I'm stamping the show. This, mm. this is what my first song is. Because we was doing back and forth on the songs, it was like a versus. Yeah, yeah. And that was my first choice. Wow. He was checking your hat for razors. Yeah, man, I get it. <laughs> that was hilarious. <laughs> yeah, I get it. He was like, take off your hat. I'm like, what's that? I was like, wow, this smart man puts a gun underneath the leg. So, uh, so hold up. This, uh, hold up. This was a versus type thing that you had it like they set up. Yeah, that was that was the. That was and you like, just perform your tr- you performing the track. No, nah, yeah, I was. Um, it was like a versus. Mm-hmm. So I was performing the songs that that he was picking the, the New York the New York songs. Yeah, yeah. Okay, be a New York versus that I picked. But he was performing like it was his shit, and yeah. the crowd was going nuts. Like, yeah, oh. I'm a natural born performer, so yeah, he, yeah, yeah, he was like, he was like, yeah, perform the song. I was like, perform the song, say that, yeah. and I just <laughs> and I performed the song, and people was rocking with it like heavy, and it yeah. really like just kind of people was hitting me up afterwards. It was like, yo, bro, you that that was planned out, like y'all yeah. y'all did that a certain time. Who are you? Why did you come and like body that so well? I was like, oh, I'm chilling. You know what I mean? I'm just here. And you just live in the moment, yeah, man. Yeah, you yeah. live in the moment. Yeah, you vibe was, out, bro. You vibe out. I ain't gonna hold you. I felt like it was. It, it really felt like it was supposed to happen. <clears throat> and um, some of the most positive shit in the world has happened to me, straight as a domino effect of that. Unexpectedly, yeah. unexpectedly, yeah. and it's beautiful. Unexpected. And I know you captured. You've captured a, a lot of those positive moments. And unpleasant moments. And I think my man in Down Music has you in some compromising <laughs> position. <laughs> <laughs> hey, yo. Hey, yo. Oh I don't know. Oh, what's up? So, so, take it. so check so, it out. <laughs> <laughs> Good looks, Fix. Hey, so yo. we we've been studying you, we've been watching you move. We've been stalking your, your you know, your social medias. And we got some 
some photos of you doing some crazy shit, Damn. of you doing this, that, <laughs> some illegal shit. <laughs> and right now, though. and Statue right now, we just need answers. We need some explanation. You we got need him. A, you, call, you call him getting sturdy. You call him getting sturdy. I don't know if they post it. <laughs> Damn. And you got sturdy on world? him. <laughs> <laughs> nah, it's bad. Y'all ain't been on my my kid's TikTok, right? Because it's real bad for me. If he, he, um, yeah, my father. I don't want to. Now I'm going to listen to that shit. Just talking about this shit, right? He I'm going to hit that nigga he right now. a couple of pictures. I'm hitting yeah, that yeah, nigga yeah. right now. Yeah, he's like, yo, he used this for that, that segment. We're like, I'm right. beating all right, so, his so, so let's yo, go. Give we a got shout out to your son. So we go. So everybody can find everybody can find all the. It's the, happening, the, the, guys. The off, off the, off the, off the, off the script, Solomon Jones. Oh, here we go. So Shout real out quick, son. before we get started, <laughs> this segment, this segment is called "Searching for Solo Jones." You heard? Mm. So first, first pick that we got. Talk about it, brother. Oh, I'm in the I'm in the woods, man. I'm in the woods. That's just a still of a video. It's a Talk big, about the video. Was, all right, so that's the video for reaching. I was supposed to put out that video some time ago, and um, like you and the compo taking a dump. Yeah, <laughs> that, 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 that's just that's just a compromise and still right the there. Tree, but if you play the whole video though, you feel me? A nigga who's cooking inside the motherfucker in the forest. You feel me? I had as a flash, I was wearing my company um joint. You feel me? The rain suit and shit like that. I went straight to the forest. Me and Kells and we was just started shooting. We was like, yo, this is what we want to do. You doing this shit right here, right now? I was like, facts. Let's do this shit. <laughs> and then that's it. Now we have a video. What was the... I didn't even put that shit out yet. What was the inspiration behind that? I couldn't find that on YouTube. Oh, I wasn't yeah, put, put it out. Yeah, yeah. What I was the inspiration behind that? Whole? There was absolutely no inspiration behind that. We was in the fucking <laughs> woods and it just finished raining and it was a nice looking... It was a nice looking woods. It, oh, because we found the... um. We found a really nice. I'm gonna be honestly. I'm gonna be real, real all the way live with you. I'm gonna let you know when it's like, oh no, nah, no, we sat there and I had like this whole brilliant, thought up, elaborate yeah, idea. Uh, this absolutely the fuck not, bro. We was in the fucking woods. I was upstate. I had a test. I was doing some shit for my job. We was in the woods. Um, because we was passing by the area. It had a nice creek, a nice like spot where I could like shoot the drone and get like this really cool joints. So I was like, what the fuck are we gonna shoot? Let's figure it out. I'm going through my songs. Oh, we ain't do nothing for reaching. Let's do reaching real quick. Does it look right? <laughs> ah, yeah, bet. Let's do that shit. And now we got a video for reaching. First That's right, exactly yeah. how to work, you know. No, it is what it is. Yeah. Well, I tell you this much: it look fire. The, you you haven't put up the video yet, but from what I saw, I'm, I'm gonna post it. Official. Those yeah. drone shots, like going over the water, mm -hmm. you coming out like out the. Yo, you look like uh, some Tarzan, like some crazy mm -hmm. shit. Official. Mm -hmm. Appreciate that. Yeah, I always say it's all that. about the editing. Yeah, when it comes to music that. videos, it's all about the editing. <laughs> you got this one. You gotta explain, bro. This is hilarious, <laughs> man. Yo, that yo. Yo, talk about <laughs> that, bro. What's that about, yo. man? <laughs> Ah, that's Theo murder. <laughs> that's 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 Theo. Um, Let me show the rest of the crew. <laughs> Uncle Murder's there trying to spit some game, man. He not giving a fuck. So, so, so Theo, Theo telling me something, and and I I wasn't blatantly not listening. I was just doing stuff. You feel me? I was actually working that day, so I was getting my shot set up. Even though it doesn't really look like I was doing that at all, it actually just looks like I'm in my phone. Not paying attention to niggas whatsoever. That's actually probably exactly what's going on. I was a piece of shit, man. Don't listen to me, man. <laughs> but what was he saying? You remember what he was telling you? Absolutely not, bro. I'm in my phone. I don't know what the fuck he telling me. <laughs> Joking. Nah, nah, that's my bro. That's that's real life. That's that's bro. Um, God bless that man. He is he is in my in our eyes in the hood eyes. That that man is is up there with my with Mariah Carey for the holidays, bro. You are a needed man. And everything you do in this world is appreciated, bro. Never stop doing them shits. The wrap ups, Every, right? The wrap ups. Rap -ups right? The wrap up shits is important to our fucking. He culture. took over. He, yes. It yeah. was somebody and else. Skills, Skiller. Too. skills, 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 skills as well. You can't. We, we also, yeah, we can't. We can't mention one without mentioning the other. That's just the, the respectful thing to do in this world. Shout out, Mad Skills. What y'all do is very important to our culture. Please don't stop that shit. Mm -hmm. All right, all right. So let's let's go with this one. This one. Very impressive. I'm really good with these answers. I ain't gonna hold you. Yeah, he's doing. You doing good. That's doing another. Good. That's see. That's see this. Fire, this bro. was. This right here. This was a day. And we gonna say you have to sit back for this. Oh, yeah, shit. man. Now nah, that's was, real. This was a time, man. It was um, me and that man sitting right over here. This this guy. His name is Cyrus the God. Cyrus the God. Yeah. And um. Cyrus the virus. And, and me and me and Cyrus. <laughs> nah, we, nah, um, nah, chill. 
No, no. No le, ponga, no le diga <laughs> eso. He tried to call you COVID. Chica, chicas. <laughs> he, tried, he said you malaria, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> Get her that. But set this up for us, yo. How you how you how you met him? Look at this. Look at this picture, yo. The, the the fucking skyline is in the background. It looked like it should look important as fuck. Yeah, nah. Look, it's the picture from Eight Fest with um with uh with Rosenberg. Yeah. That's oh, big, so yo. manager. So That's okay, so so it's just you just see Peter Rosenberg right there, but you know Paul, yeah. Paul, Paul, ooh, not, wow. Paul not Peter Rosenberg. I guilt hey, myself. <laughs> Sorry, guys. My I'm man. mad New York. I just guilt myself. Yo, <laughs> give me mines. I gave myself mines. <laughs> Yo, um, oh, what's his name was there too? Uh, Russell Simmons, Russell Simmons. Was, was in the oh, back. Oh yeah, yeah. Before, before, before he during the whole time before he bounced the whole time he was just there. No, it was, he was he left the country. He came back. No, that was that night. That was. And then he that, left. I don't know what name is out. Yeah, well, he left. But that night, nah, he was fest. he was on that event. That, that, that event. show that we was at. Oh, yeah. When was that? That was like September, October, or some shit. Yeah, that was. Oh yeah. Oh, so he's back now because he he had a little thing thing going on, and then he had to be fled the country. He came back because he had some <laughs> oh, like wow. cleaned it up. Bill Cosby ish shit going on. Oh wow. Yeah. <laughs> well, I mean, that's, that's yeah, let's get back to it. Yeah, so. yeah. Allegedly, oh, allegedly. Yeah. <laughs> Allegedly. All allegedly. Allegedly. All allegedly. allegedly. I'm interested in what you guys talked about. Like, how how did it happen? I was there saying my name 30,000 times. I was like, and my name is Solomon Jones, you know, just in case you don't forget. And, we was, <laughs> and I would bring, I was talking about some other shit. We talked about the light, stars, moons, and the shit. But, and then my name, but you know, Solomon Jones, you know what I mean? Can't forget that. And he was like, bro. I know your name, bro. I get, I, I get it. I was like, you know, just for future reference, you never know what's going to happen out of here and shit like that. So I guarantee you, I promise you today, you walk up to him and you be like, you know, you know Solomon Jones? He probably going to look at you like, where you at? <laughs> <laughs> like, that motherfucker was here? He that motherfucker here? This motherfucker going to come, come in here and say his name to me. But I'm out. I'm leaving. <laughs> We used that's to that motherfucker up. annoying them niggas. You know what? <laughs> that's how that shit stick though. You make you making it stick. Nah, nah. It's like music. Like you look, you turn on the radio. <laughs> no. The radio plays the same shit over, over all day. That's just stick. It stick. Mm -hmm. yeah, stick to your ribs, right? Like yo. So that was ill. That's marketing yeah, right there. That's know, marketing. We was really in there just had, trying to have, you know, real conversation. Yeah, we, <laughs> we, we, we was, but we wasn't. No, we was, we was, we was having good. No, nah, we, we had good energy. Yeah, we had you, great you energy. Know, That's shit. Yeah. But I'm like, nah, <laughs> this is the one time I'm like, yo, bro, you, I'm like, yo, you M manager. Is drilling that shit. Like, you, you a staple of my childhood. And he goes, why? Because I was on Marshall Mathers OP doing the skit. I said, yes. What? Why would you ask me that? Of course. That's the reason why you a staple of my childhood. Hell Are yeah. you not the staple of other people's childhood? Do people not come up to you and tell you this? He was like, yeah, all the, you know, all the time. And I'm like, <laughs> yeah, accept yeah. it, bro. What the fuck? Yeah, Own right. it. Damn. Take flowers. Shit. Take, flowers. Take your shit and just, just smile and fucking have a great day man and then we just talking about the shit he was there with his wife and other um constituents it was a lot of uh nft bros there that night yeah okay, okay. it was a big nft event mm. yeah it was a lot of artists a lot, on, of, a lot you of big on nfts yes. Nah, rest in peace, <laughs> NFTs, y'all. <laughs> rest in peace, y'all. Hey, you got a space and it's got a market. Know. You don't, you know. You what never mean? know. I know some people that 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 really fuck with the market really heavy. I know some people that that made their dollars during the time yeah. it was time to make dollars. And I know some niggas that's in the fucking dirt. Yeah. Right now, that nigga in the dirt, just like that. There's an artist <laughs> we had up, and, and we had up here. <laughs> on our platform his name is arts he's big on nfts he in the dirt mm -hmm. sorry nah he's good he's good nah he's yeah, rocking right? him. Yeah, he's, he's still rocking, rocking. Okay. he's up he's up but see if you know how to milk the market yeah you know no and that's, still, that's the whole yeah. that's how we found out and learned about nfts we we're like what the fuck is that we were dinosaurs yeah no he gave us a whole tutorial the game yeah. as long as that whole episode was a fucking tutorial you can, you can literally find your way into the right because all right the money is not the same because ethereum was all the way down the market mm. the whole crypto market it's coming is up it's way. coming up. all right yeah no no we have bull runs there's yeah. sometimes we have some of this but the market's in the ass yeah. the whole the whole shit if you look at these like yeah, numbers it really not, you know what i mean we're like 
in the in the dirt, all of us, all our portfolios look like shit. Mm-hmm. I don't I mean, know who. That shit. I don't know whose portfolio looks good. You know what I mean? I, mean, I, I used to look. I remember I, I was looking at that shit every day. I don't even look at that yo, shit. For bro. real, I, I forgot, forgot the password, like bro. Time, my man was like, "Yo, he's like, yo, everybody's a fucking stockbroker. Like everybody's a fucking. Bro, that's what it is. Yeah, we all thought we knew what we. Everybody, yeah, yeah, everybody. everybody did did that, all right, everybody let's get to the next one. Let's get to the next one. I had dodge coin. I feel like you are always in the right spot, man. The right place at the right time? Yes, sir. Shit, I wish. Talk about this one right here. Oh, shit. All right. So this this, seems like a throwback. So this is a big ass throwback. This actually came and worked full circle for me uh, a few times. Um, So no beard. Yeah, no beard. Well, I had a little bit of beard. I had I had facial hair. I ain't yeah, had no beard. Yeah, it was a bird. Had, yeah, it was bird. a bird. I had, you know what I mean? <laughs> no, it wasn't a bird. It was a little bird. It was there. It was just wasn't there. So this is a picture of me and Rowdy Rebel from, um, I used to work as a cameraman, like I told y'all before, because I um, was broke. And you can see the camera that's in my hand right there on the bottom. Um, and I worked for a website, strictlyhiphop.com. Shout out to them. They Shout out to helped, Strictly. Yeah, yeah. They yeah, actually held me down for a long time. We actually oh, was working together up. for some years. And um, what would happen was uh, Strictly would have these interviews with artists, and I would either be the cameraman for the interview or I'd be the interviewer or, yeah, you know, whatever the case was. Wow. So that's what actually how I grew a lot of my a lot of relationships with most artists, one mm. being Rowdy, uh, Uncle Murda, this that's a part on. of that's a part of the the the, the grind. Yeah, that's part of the culture. That's yeah, a part of the, the grind and learning and and learning the whole the whole you know right. everything everything right. as far as you know the, the 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 media part of it, you know the the video the the videographer the, the videography is that even a fucking word I don't yeah. know but yeah. you know no, that whole that is, it is. no shout out to them because <clears> I, I was and, and he knew because I was very vocal I'm very vocal about everything I do but he was he he allowed me to advance my brand and career as Solo Jones through being a videographer or through being a host or just being, you know, working for the site. I was, a, he, it allowed me to, to spread my brand because obviously when I have these relationships with these artists, it helps me out in a certain mm-hmm. light. You right. know, we're, we, now we're building something. Now I got a song with him or now you, you know, doing, using my beat or using my, my bars or whatever I'm writing for X, Y, Z. Whatever the case might be, but a lot of those doors opened up for me being a videographer. Wow, yeah. oh, right. that's, that's a special thing because mm-hmm. you know what I'm saying. Um, you kind of like interning, yeah, you know type shit. Yeah. yeah, type shit. And except I was getting paid for that. Right. Oh, so you wasn't? You were paid yeah. intern, but a lot of times you got to do shit for free. No, yeah, you start off for free, but for, you know to what learn. Mean? Yeah, just to learn what's going on. But this shit was a job too. Works. At the end of the day, like I yeah. like I told you, I got into this because I needed I needed money. Mm. I needed to learn how. To, first of all, it was a necessity because I needed my own shit shot. I needed my own videos, my own my own album covers, my own everything, my own photo shoots, my own whatever I could do. And secondly, you know what I mean. Once you figured that out, I was online with it. I was like, yo, ah, uh, uh, hundred twenty five dollars photo shoots. You know what I mean? Come, mm-hmm. come see shots by Jones. Ah, ah. Um. You know? and that's how you had to, you had to cook. We had to make money. Get so, it, get yeah. it, grinding, grinding. You know I mean? Honestly, job, you, you live people. in New York. A job ain't enough here, bro. I'm a whole father you need on child three, support. Four hustles bro. over here. I need three jobs right. and a little three, bit of fraud on the side. Hustles to fucking survive in New York. And you need, you need Christ <laughs> and Jesus. <laughs> and Jesus right. on you the need, side. You need three jobs, and sell Jesus drugs, on the side. Some fraud, and Jesus. <laughs> All right. Last but not least. Last but not least, y'all. We got the last, the last picture right here, and we we kind of mentioned it before, but. It's it's great to go come full circle, yo. Yeah, nah, this was this was such a great night, man. This is the Roy and uh Roy and Mouth shot. It's such a great night. I thought you were talking about tonight because tonight is a great night. This is a great night right here, too. (laughs) There's greatness going on. Don't you fucking mistake this shit. Uh, That Roy and Mouth night though, man. That was that was that was something so special, man. That's something I won't forget ever. Shout out to them. Shout out to to Mal for um for honoring my Timberloot, my Timberland boot status. Yeah. I see they responded <laughs> um, when you posted it up. It, it, we actually um keep contact, which fire, is great. Fire, wow. fire. You know I mean? We be. Yeah, I listen to that podcast, man. Me too, They're man. Great. They're, They're great. really entertaining folk. I really, I really enjoy them. Mm. And 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 you know what's crazy, man? I'm gonna, I'm gonna give you some more insight about that night. Yeah, yeah. I wasn't, I wasn't gonna make it to that show. Wow. I wasn't even supposed to go to that show. 
I never had tickets to that show. <laughs> I was invited last the last minute, the night before I was invited. Oh. My man Kev hit me up. He was like, yo, I'm going to shout out to Kev. Yo, you know, this would have happened without you. you. Um, he hit me up and he goes, Yo, I'm I'm going to the to the Royal Mile joint. It was a Friday night too. I was exhausted. I got a lot going on. Um, I'm dealing with work and you know trials and tribulation. My car fucking up. Everything fucking up. I'm, on, I'm dealing with you know what I mean. I'm home the shit. Kids. You know, it's like life shit happening. Mm-hmm. I wasn't even gonna make it that night. I was like, yo, bro, I don't even think this is gonna <laughs> happen for me, bro. It's like six o'clock. I'm still doing the most car and I started and it's crazy for your boy. I was you like, stubbed yo. your toe. Like, yeah, you man. He's like, I got no more weed. It's like, yo, turmoil, turmoil. <laughs> Everything I don't know what's going on. wrong went <laughs> wrong. Everything that was bad was bad. Just raining on me personally. That's it. Nobody else. So, so I'm like, yo, but I don't even think this is going to happen for me. But uh, I just was like, nah, I'm going to go. I'm, 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 I got to push through. So, you know what I mean? I'm, I'm not going to disappoint my homie because that was really what more about it uh resilience making man. sure that mm-hmm. my homie didn't feel alone and yeah you didn't you didn't leave him hanging, hanging. yeah you know, keeping so. your word so i got there man's word is everything you heard there, it, it, all it, you got like, is your word nah, that's a fact that's all you got is your, your word is, is your word is bond bro uh-huh. I told him, I was like yo this is what i'm gonna do I'm, I'm gonna make sure you know what i mean you're not out there alone and shit like that mm-hmm. and yeah so yeah nah and then that shit turned into my show fuck out of here <laughs> <laughs> Yo, it definitely yeah, turned him into the Solomon Jones Fact. show. Yeah. And, and it wasn't like uh it wasn't cell phone footage. You had <laughs> legit footage. The cameras turned on you. You know yeah. what I'm saying? That's that's facts, yeah, yo. That's man. fire. That was it was a good night, man. It was it was a good night and we 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 kind of put our foot down. Mm. You know, we put our foot down for a lot of people that didn't know who we was. You put your foot in that ass, you heard? A lot of people oh. was like a lot of people I I a lot of people came to me after that show and was like, yo, who are you? What do you do? You know you know how to do this. Like, this is your thing. You're too comfortable on stage. What is it that you do? <laughs> oh, I may or may not be an artist. You should listen to some music. That explains this. Mm. This makes a lot more sense to me now because you on stage cooking for no reason. Mm. Like, you got to chill. It's regular <laughs> right, night. Right. What are you doing? You trying to take it over. <laughs> no like, yo, hold on. Slow down. Slow down, down, down pal. Relax. Yo, it got to a point. <laughs> Well, I think it was uh, Mal. He was like, "Yo, he just stepped back." He was yeah, like, "Yeah, nah." He was like, Damn. I, yeah. He that took was, it. Like, Yo, let, let him loose. Nah, I, I peeped it. I peeped. I yeah. peeped game. That, it was, we spoke about it after the show, and <laughs> it, was, it was just such a great. I haven't seen it, and I'm gonna check it out. Yeah, it's great. It's on my but YouTube. But just from what I'm hearing from the, and you know, these niggas, I, I take whatever they say. Y'all niggas should learn how to control the crowd and and control the moment. It means a lot. Just off of what I can, I can hear and what I'm seeing, a lot. soaking in, control the moment. Any moment you win, right? Even if she's moaning. Mm. And that right there, y'all, is searching for Solo Jones, you heard? Bam. We found him. Yeah, I'm right here, guys. <laughs> <laughs> you searching, you shall find. <laughs> exactly, right, exactly. Man. Next we're gonna segment. Cut part one. That's gonna be part one. We, we still rolling. Yeah, we still rolling, brother. Still rolling. Yeah, we rolling, rolling. <laughs> uh, <laughs> yo, look. So, <laughs> can we? Can we? Can That's we smoke? Blue That's a blue <laughs> Can I smoke on camera? Absolutely, absolutely. And we're and, and like, we're about to really? look. There's so much things that you've done. So many videos. So much songs. So many events, so oh, many yeah. people you met. We and we're going to have to cut this. Yeah, we're mm. going to have to get into it. Part two? Yeah. All right, fuck it. Yeah, yeah. How long, yeah. how long yeah. is this episode? Let's take a, let's take a, how long is this episode? Let's take a trip to the back. It's tomorrow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yo, we'll be back with part two, you heard? <laughs> Solo Jones. We'll be back. While I'm on this west side highway, I sit Keys swing by my knees, fist full of my dreams Pistol by the sea, piss but what it seems I fish for all I need, kiss this sun at ease This wonder without a breeze So I be wasting my time, but what's the latest? Sitting in this traffic, they asking if he gon' make it Break a break a one nine, what's your location? Don't even count me in, the furthest thing from the station Shit, look I'm paving the road I took the long way cause I ain't paying the toll I be keeping track of every dollar I grow So I just hope I add up to everything in my nose I'm making the toast every Saturday, baby She asked where I'm going I see that away, baby So catch me when it's early Hit and mad me, baby They copy and they paste That shit is flattery, baby It's flattery, baby Yeah I said it's flattery, baby It's copy and they paste That shit is flattery, baby Come on, man Ooh, man Fuck my way, man 
I've been, I've been playing, got a million on the mind. 30 on the meter, on the D can take a ride. Shit, I'm feeling eager, I ain't sleeping many nights. Build up at the exit at 149. Shit, start the way in the base, always playing, cause you know I got my own shit ringing, it's a vibe. I ain't never had to be the type to ever hide who I am and hesitate to punch a nigga in his eye. Income message, about to answer it. Who the fuck is this? Another email. Solo Jones, move the public, or put the song out, move it. They in love with it, but still I'm at work. I don't fuck with it, I'm just paving the road I took the long way cause I ain't paying the toll Cheap old boy, I'm just keeping it honest I'ma be rich and still stealing from Target Look, I believe in the living without the sleep I'm in a space where I'm considered the OG I'm moving crowds, rocking the rooms without the key And I'm very loud with what my intentions intend to be Look, I've been keeping it cool, the solid minded The two refined, don't get in line with the simple lies I get behind it, need the pack, but from the side of True provider, shit hard as a solid diamond Yeah I'ma get where I'm going, but in a moment, I sit alone with me the road to serotonin. I'm not receiving, cause this traffic don't leave me alone. Yeah. Yeah. That, that means I'm, I'ma be fucking late. That's it. There's, there's no which way around it. You mad, I'm mad, we both in this predicament together. Yeah. Nah, damn it, I'm late. Holy Jesus, I'm late. Damn it, I'm late. I'm, I'm late. Hey. All it is, I'm late. I'm, I'm late. Hey. 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 Damn it, I'm late. I'm late. Hey. Oh no, all it is, I'm late.